one of my latest happenings, a red carpet events in and around Los Angeles. You're watching On the Red Carpet. Get the latest Hollywood news brought to you by Pacific Rim Photos and Videos. Your eye on the red carpet. Hey Janelle, we are here at the Japanese American National Museum and behind me on stage is Dan Matthews premiering songs from his brand new album, Stuntman. But earlier he talked to us about his documentary, AKA Dan. Dan's family is from South Korea, but he was adopted here in America and the documentary follows him as he goes back to South Korea to meet his family for the first time. Dear Dan Matthews, I'm writing to share the information of your birth family. As you may be aware, your birth parents were married and still are married. They have one son and they have a daughter. You may also find that your brother Ji Seong is actually your twin brother. We talked to your mom. Your mom's so cute, by the way. Uh, yeah, she's been a really good sport throughout yeah. this entire thing. It's really amazing. I think that one of the reasons why I felt the empowerment to go out and be able to do what I did was because my biological, my family, not my biology, my family was very supportive here. Yeah. Yeah. And they said that, she said that they might like actually meet and you know, like yeah. your parents might meet and so that's pretty cool, right? I think that's the dream. I think that we'll give it some time. Every, every, it's, it's all time now. Yeah. So we'll see what happens. With AK Dan the documentary and Stuntman the album, it's been a big night for Dan and some of his celebrity friends give him well wishes. Dan, Wong Fu Productions loves you. I couldn't be happier for you, and uh, you're just a really good person, and I hope you're going to go really far in life. Hey, man, we're just so proud of you, man, to be a part of the family, the ISA TV family. Thank you for taking the time. I love the fact that you're blessed with this. Couldn't happen to a better person. Brother, you are uh, such a great guy, and uh, I'm so happy that you're my friend, and I'm even more happy that uh, you've been able to go on this journey and and, and find some pieces and of your life. and. Uh, and just find peace, I think, and I can't wait to see where, what happens next. We talked to a Phil Am music producer, Travis, who also is an artist himself, and he tells us a little bit about what he's got going on. I'm part of a band called New Heights, and we're kind of like an alternative rock pop group out of Seattle. Um, I just moved down to L.A., so we're kind of doing the whole West Coast thing. Uh, but, yeah, it's, it's kind of like that, and... Um, I guess if you like One Republic, because One Republic's like our favorite band, yeah. then you sh might like our stuff. <laughs> you know? How did how did you become part of this whole night? How do you know Dan? How did you become you so, know performing? Yeah, so me and Dan go way back. We've been good friends for a long time. But I actually um, mixed and uh, co-produced uh, and engineered his album. So a lot of the songs he did tonight are. Um, uh, a, a few of my productions and uh, co-writes with Dan and everything. So the whole bit, so I'm like, because the album hasn't released yet, I'm like the only guy, like I'm like sitting side stage, mouthing every word, because I've listened to every single song like 40 <laughs> times. Yeah, yeah. You're like, I love this song. And everybody's like, okay, stalker, how do you know? I know, and everyone's like, how the heck does he know everything? I'm like, I'm a super fan, man. At para naman sa mga naghahanap ng Valentine's Day movie date, you may want to check this one out. Hey Janelle, we are out here in Hollywood at the Harmony Gold Theater for the premiere of Lust for Love. And as you can see, love is in the air. Let's talk to them and find out why this is the perfect Valentine's Day film. 21 years and 43 days since our last kiss. Wow. <laughs> Do we just kiss? We are four years old. Right. What do you think's going to be happier, your mom or mine? Probably yours. So tell us a little bit about your character. He's kind of at that point where he's trying to win like his childhood crush back. Yeah. And there's some awkward moments. Yeah, he, uh, he's like painfully uh, innocent, oblivious, naive when it comes to women. Um, you know, he'd be an extreme of that guy that like, uh, just needs all the help he can get with girls. Um, I thought I knew a lot more about women than I did. And then filming the movie, I, I sort of realized I was more like this guy than I care to admit. Um, you know, uh, but he... he, he it's, it makes you cringe, but I think it's ultimately like a charming character, you know. Valentine's Day is coming up. Why does everybody have to make this their Valentine's Day film? What about it do you think is going to be perfect for the 14th? Um, it's, it will not make you feel bad about yourself if you're in a really bad relationship. Um, it's not one of those like sappy romantic films, but it's fun, it's light, it's an easy film to watch, and I think people can relate to a certain degree. It's a quirky, lovely film that they'll walk away feeling good from, and and uh, Aster is like the quintessential romantic, and it's funny and enjoyable. We're a player, are we? 
No, I'm just being friendly. So, Janelle, the red carpet is done, but one thing you guys don't always get to see is what happens at the end of the carpet is all the actors come back out and do this kind of cool group shot. Signing out for On the Red Carpet with Pacific Rim Video, it's Chris Tronson here for Lust for Love. Thank you, Chris. Thank you, Peter. If you want more uh, Pacific Rim, nasa social media po sila, different sites on your screens right now. Those are just snippets of their coverage. So if you want more or the full coverage, that's where you need to go. Also, on the show, uh, Kababayan today, we would love to hear from you. Email us, also tweet with us, like us on Facebook, send us a message, or watch us on YouTube, youtube.com slash kababayanla18. Marami po salamat sa inyong pagsubaybay. Ako po si Janelle So, ang inyong kababayan sa Los Angeles. I'll see you again tomorrow.